This is a HP. It is a uh, HP-14 model, R033TU. Had a liquid spill and some of the keys stopped working. So I'm going to show you how to quickly fix that. Now with most liquid spilled laptops, there is definitely internal damage on the motherboard. But uh, we'll go into another video of uh, showing the faults of this laptop. But here I'll show you how to fix the issue where some of the keys are working only. Here's the laptop turned on. I'm at the login screen, and I'll show you. I press a couple of the a couple of the keys, and they're not working. Some keys are working, but it's really weird behavior. As you can see, I'm tapping away, and only sometimes some keys are working. We'll need to remove the keyboard in this case, and have a look at the ribbon cable. See if there is any damages. And most of the time, ribbon cables can be cleaned out make sure the gold contacts or the metal contacts are nice and uh, shiny. So in this model the keyboard is held by two screws. Now the keyboard is out, you can see there is sticky residual stuff around and the connections are not making proper contacts because of the uh, liquid, it looks like a coffee or maybe coke or something similar. So we're going to get the alcohol wipes out and just give them a nice good clean. Give it a nice good clean with alcohol or you can use petrol. And now let's do a test. Okay, here we go. As you can see, we got more keys showing up. Backspace is working. And all the alphabet keys seem to be working. I'll show the, uh, yeah, as you can see, all the keys are now typing. This is a simple fix, um, so you may want to try if you got liquid or damage of some sort on the ribbon cables due to the liquid. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to support this channel.